You can see camera set up here. We're getting this shot over here and the colors in the sky just look beautiful. Pastely pinks and purples and blue, it just looks great. So out again with Coops and we've come to Montrose to a lighthouse which is up there. Scurvy Nace Lighthouse. Eh? It's called Scurvy So there's the lighthouse coming out of my head. Just going to try and have a wander around now. We've got a little bit of time before the sun comes up. So we're going to see what's about. <laughs> so we're having a look at some different spots Coops has decided to go there and I'm going to have a little I'm going to set up down here for a little bit and we'll see what happens but I guess choosing the right composition is the whole battle because if you get that wrong, you get everything wrong. So, who knows? You can see camera set up here. We're getting this shot over here and the colors in the sky just look beautiful. Pastely pinks and purples and blue, it just looks great. Goops is getting some good shots as well, I think. Just about made it, just about got to the spot in time. Three minutes before it breaks the horizon. And we've got three minutes till it breaks the horizon, I'm reliably informed. So, yeah, it's a good day. Well, behind me now, Behind me now is one of the most impressive sunrises I think I've seen in a long old time. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. Let me see what we can do. Just a perfect circle of sun. Looks awesome. I think, I don't want to, I shouldn't say it too soon, but I think I've got something that's going to look all right out of that. Uh, the colours in the sky were just spectacular. There's no other word for it really, eh? No, it really isn't. Just looked awesome. Even if it was 15 minutes, it was still better than nothing. Uh, short and sweet. And yeah, that was, that was impressive made it worthwhile getting up. Well, I say that now. We've got to wait and see what happens in the light room first, I guess, but... <laughs> My heart says it was worth it. <laughs> Come away from where we were taking those pictures of the lighthouse. Just coming down now to the, the water's edge. There's some lovely rocks down here and uh, don't think the tide's coming in, but we'll go and see down there.
think we're going to head away from here and rumour has it that there is here in Montrose a an abandoned mental hospital yeah. was it psychiatric hospital probably mental isn't the uh, politically correct term. Probably not, no. <laughs> so we're going to go and try and see where that is because that could be somewhere for the future and seeing as we're here we might as well have a look So we have found the old, uh, can't say mental hospital, psychiatric hospital, <laughs> just over here. It's uh, It's been abandoned for some amount of time. It doesn't look like too long, to be honest, because with a lick of paint and that, it looks like it could be quite a nice hotel. Uh, we're gonna go and see what we can see. So we've been walking around this place here, discussing weird things and imagining people in windows and stuff. And I've just looked around and there's a sign over this way that says main building this way. So God knows what that is, but we'll go and see what the, what the real deal's about. I'm just getting this weird feel, like end of days, yeah, walking you know dead this, feel. This almost would be a perfect location for that sort of stuff. Eh? zombie horror. Yeah, this, this is where the outbreak started. Yeah. This is ground zero for the zombie apocalypse. This place, this huge gaff here, and then there's another one down there, and there's something over there, and <laughs> there's something over there. There's just building after building after building. You look dead on, you can see the lighthouse. This lens, you can't. I don't think you get it with that lens, but you can see the lighthouse we were just that half an hour ago. So you could spend some proper time exploring around here. Yeah. But I still do get a strange feeling. Yeah, that you've been watched. <laughs> <laughs> I was just saying to Coops how I'm struggling here with the camera. It's hard for me to, I've never been anywhere like this before for a start. And I've never taken pictures of anything like this before either. And it's kind of weird. It's like my eye isn't ready to see what it's seeing or I can't see any pictures. But I just came across this door. And for some reason, it grabbed me. So I quite like that. Well, that's us going home now. This is some place. Uh, Got to come back here with my drone for a start, I think, to just see how big it is, because it's just enormous. Everywhere we go, there's a new building. And uh, it would be great to get in, in a couple of these and see what the inside's like, but we'll have to see if that's possible. So that's it for today, heading home now, time for some breakfast. Thanks very much for watching. Uh, all the links for all the pictures and things you can find on down below for Instagram and Facebook. I'll put Coops's up as well so we can have a look, see what he got. Until next time, take care.